Shut on down. Great shots by Boostio. Uh. With still a minute toast. However, the issue is version one plentiful utility off that double initiator. Yeah, do have heaps of utility. FP still full. Gonna be armorless. And well, Xander, unfortunately, not gonna find his way into the fight. He's taken down early. And Evil Geniuses nearly making this one a clean sweep. But it's Penny and Zelsis to finally answer back with the ghost and the paint shells. And we find ourselves even here in the pistol as Apoth plays That's just atop the box out towards short. They're trying to play the high low. Apoth's gonna trade it out. Penny has his back turn, was expecting a player up towards heaven. But instead, Apoth now with 75 HP spots the shoulder of the sky, and Penny gonna look to play around the spike, and the shots will land, it's a huge round for Penny. That is massive to find, a 4k for this man. Let's think, first of all, how that started, it's keeping EG accountable. They'll be able to retake, no matter how much time they buy, and talk of time, we're down to 30 seconds, this probably has to just be a straight up hit towards B. Maybe if you teleport, teleport, there's still resistance on the opposite side of the map on that A side, it's Penny to find the first. Jogamo down, flashes out of the sky, smoke Penny on the swing, but it's Boostio and Reformed to open up the site, but there's one more waiting inside the tube. Epi's gonna be taken down, and Bordell, he pushes through the halls, he falls as well, and you said this round was so important for version one as they reinvested into it, and now it's all up to Zelsus, and he's got nothing. Boostio goes huge with three. ...spot here, however, they're aiming to get Wardell, his tour of force online, EG realizes that. They ...over the top, the paint shells to follow, and the util's been used, the teleporter, it's available, and there's still 50 seconds. We have time here. They just want to track down on as much utility as possible, but Wardell has an angle, finds a shot onto Kong. This feels like... Okay, guys, the only weapon that they might have is right here on this site. Maybe we want to go elsewhere as Wardell will find another Xander going to hop into the kill feed. And it's a thrifty round. On down, another one of these rounds where EG is running it close on the time, but Wardell swings dry, loses out to Bustio. This will pull rotations towards B, but it was all part of a fake. EG to double back in towards this A site, but have they waited too long? Xander back on the scene, but denied. Finally, a couple of big kills going the way of Evil Geniuses, but they just have to try and hold the site down now. With 3v5s, that spike will be planted. Bustio still two to force in hand. It's calm. Playing the long con, headed all the way around. All three defenders coming from the top side of the map and make it two defenders. Jogmo finds a second kill on the round. It's Penny to fall to paint shells. Buy some space, buy some time, and this is looking... Utility to set him up, but if you can catch the timing right, be closer than he expects. You can take him on down, take that as a pivot. Short, this is the right spot, but reform should flash him off the line. Moves around, doesn't quite get the shot. Still, no punishment as he falls away. And Xander still holding towards Chalice. If Xander can hold on to this space, that can be huge. The showstopper, though, trades on to Wardell. And Xander, now he's pinched in a bit of trouble here. Yeah, he's got some time, although the incendiary seems to have just subsided. And Bustio, well, he's welcoming inside the Sky Smoke. will take Xander down and one spike. Landed out towards this side. This time, though, the defenders, they're here, and they're here fast. Celsus will be first on the take. Takes down Revolt. It's done there, and then after Flash on the end, the Johnny's alive. FPS continues to try and fight for the squad as he trades out the kill, and in such hours, Bustio falls, and it's all up to calm the Rolling Thunder. He has to send the snake bite early. He doesn't get tagged up on this. Are they ready for the fight? No, they're not. The FPS falls. Penny has to do it again. And his HP is looking just about the same. The clock is ticking. It's calm. We'll jump atop the box. The flash goes behind. It, fu it flashes Penny. And he still gets the kill. That's ridiculous. Same circumstance. Penny does it again. Calm thought he had that round in the back. Here. On round seven. And version one, they're getting antsy. Celsus wants to get aggressive, but he runs right into Bustio. And... Oh, it doesn't go Zelsus' way. Now the two players on the site, the Seekers online, running them down. Nice flash. Trying to slow things down. Orbital Strike and a force boost you to hop on out, and there's no way out from that one. A flash to sneak away. And Penny, I almost said he survives, but does he barely? 25 HP as he walks away, but everybody corralled and halt. Yeah, that they are, but still, look at the utility left. Epis has a stun, Xanders has a molly to zone, however, the ult has come out. They're going quickly in this one, Ordo, though. Finds a shot, that pit's still up, and that could be the pivotal change in this round. Jaw, oh, the Seekers were going for him. He's hidden in this corner. Does he get cleared? Absolutely not, Jaw! He grabs two. Now it's just Wardell. That's a the rounds. We saw one previously. We saw one in the pistol. And... Whoop. Did they get this one up? Okay, knives out. Nice classic shots there from Jogobo. Three kill. Wardell holding close. This duel could decide the round. <gasps> I mean, the jump peak, it was just so pretty, but it didn't matter. Wardell goes back to the angle and Bustio falls. Jogamo trying to help his teammate out and there's just nothing there for him. Does he go through the smoke? This man is a psychopath. Okay. Yeah. There's always that 
Or I cannot give up that defense just yet. Here comes the showstopper on the opposite side. It's Jogmo to find the first, but Xander battles back for one, a two for one on the B site, and the teleports. Oh, they're about to be received. They're not quite clearing the angle to do some damage. Fortunately, FB's gonna keep holding the six. We get a showstopper in response on the site. Nothing to be had. A bit of damage inside too. Performed kind of in a tight spot. Jogmo spot noted as well. And Reform now needs to battle back there. Low HP. But EG, they're no HP. And it's these mid rounds on just trying to fight Wardell early on and mid rounding off of the result of that fight. Oh, okay, never mind. I, I had a point. Can't push through it. I mean, but we've seen some some sloppy incendiaries, but for now it'll keep the defense at bay as that spike gets planted for a lie on the defense, and they're all inside the halls. Meanwhile, the post plant, where the setup's going, right? Look at Calm, he's backing all the way away. He's probably got himself a nice little lineup for this one. Yeah, that he does. Sun has already helped, though, and this aftershock could be big. Their support, however, Effie's claiming two to start the retake. Yeah, the aftershock kills is absolutely huge. The rolling thunder coming on through, and Effie's, I mean, it's really taking his ma the matters into his own hands. He's doing it all himself. He gets a kill. He tosses a util. Destroy those Seekers. So now that might pull a rotation back, but does EG go, go too quickly in this one? The utility already punishing. Yeah, the, the trap play was set up so perfect. We saw them setting up for this for so long. Finally, they get a bit of that value. This orbital strike. It gets a whole lot of nothing. It opened up some space, but a space that V1 had already taken. Now Boosie will make his way onto the site, but through the smoke he falls, and Xander gets payback inside the sky smoke. But now we find all in the 1v1 once more. It's calm, it's Penny. Penny has been good. Two out of two in situations like this, but he's not looking the right way this time around, and it's calm. Locking down the extremity and showers this round. They did actually concede that space out towards long, so a bit of a shift. EG have realized that. Now it looks like they just want to head towards B off of that information. Last down. Oh, here comes that orbital strike that you were talking about, and it gets so much value reformed. Goes down the paint shells as well. Well, you heard the grenade. Calm. And well, speaking of. Calm. What's he gonna do for the squad? The spike is here, but so is Wardell, so is Xander. They've got the cross. Once Calm looks to get aggressive, and well, Xander's got the kill. Oh, three on the round for him. Seven to five. Utility fault line into the corner. Paint shells out and over the top. Here comes the snake bite. This is gonna make these vandals, vandals, and well, everybody now getting cut down on the version one inside the cubby. Is he tucks away for just another second? He reloads, and he can't control this. The amount of damage done is so big combined. Now Xander. Very tough spot, Apoth, healthy the off angle. He utterly does the next again. The goal of this one is just damage. Will form set up. Flash forward, Apoth will swing, and Zelsus is gone. So too is Effie. How is Reform getting this done? Oh, they spotted Apoth moving behind the box as well, but I love a raise with a stinger in hand, and Jogamo able to make good on one. A weapon for three, though. He's got a vandal. He's going to try and take the angle, but Penny coming from the backside. And that spike gets planted home, man. Penny and Wardell, they got the play for this one. They're going to plant for them back in halls, and that's where they'll assume their positions. Ooh, barrel oh, spot. knows. He spots a setup. He can suspect at least one is towards the defender side of its spawn. He spotted the sky. I think he knows both are defender side of its spawn. Well, they both know that Calm is here. Poison Cloud gets a little crazy, a little sticky. When the hands are sweaty, beautiful flash, just no way out for Calm. Penny does it. Rolling Thunder available. I imagine they just pop that for Effie's. Go on towards that site. Each of like, you know, they're ready for this. They're playing a bit more passive now. We're shot onto the site. They're committed to this fight. Lucio to find the first Rolling Thunder. Gonna make things a little weird. See, Evil Geniuses scoop up a two for one on the defense, but they gotta continue fighting through as that spike is getting planted. And well, the positions. Now they're being held, and it's the same thing we saw from version 1 on defense. Everybody rotating this way, all four coming from the defender side at spawn. But look at the utility that's left. Evies has a stun, flashes to work with too. Aftershock out, it's gonna make it tough. You gotta go forward, you gotta go backwards. More time, bot as Bustio falls. The blast packs to get across, and Jogamo. Now gonna split things up as Petty going aggressive into elbow. Calm has a huge position and a huge kill. He needs some more, but both players go to fight for it. In version 1, they try to plant their feet and hang on, but they just can't do it. It's EG to tie us up. Great retake there out of Evil Geniuses. V1 started so strong in denying that. I love the satchel micro for Zelsis, throwing those forward. So with Zelsis, hope they can set Wardell up on a good angle with his attack sided off. 
Ooh, Penny just shy of information. Doesn't find the stun, so it doesn't let him know. Now the flash will confirm that information, but a showstopper coming from Jogbo will take down Wardell, and well, he's not gonna get anything. Post it forward and through the smoke. Apoth goes to cut down too as Jogbo is traded back, but favorable for evil geniuses thus far as Xander and Zelsis try to pick up the pieces. Xander gonna go aggressive outside of a smoke of his own. Nobody there to answer back, and for now, V1 stabilize. Too, but calm over towards heaven. If he can kill Xander, he could end this round. However, that dome might just be isolated. They're waiting. Buying time for the rotate to come on in. Buying time for reforms flashes to recharge. I imagine once that flashes online, that's the go signal. They're all linking up here. Headhunter in hand. Zelsis is low One HP now. No it's HP, but strike. calm that caught rotating in. Reformed! He's low HP! Xander! Other side, surely somebody has to be. Suspecting of this play, tap onto the spike. I'm gonna go smokes down, spike, spike down, down, and now they have to try and fight for this one. Is Penny gonna go on the swing? Wardell just struggling to find value with this operator in hand, and now he's even in even a tighter spot, playing so close on these angles. Out towards elbow, misses again, and his team has fallen down around him. Finally, he'll find his mark, but Apoth already posted up, ready for the next swing, and instead it's gonna be the incendiary to keep him. Stuck inside the elbow. Bulldog in hand. It's not going to be enough for FPs. And now Wardell has to do it all with 26 health. An operator in hand. And, well, the running gun specter. A weaker sight. But EG, look at that reclare. Dog went out towards long. That'll pull rotations back. Sky smoke to buy time. This is a story we've seen before. And thus far, the one has been pretty unsuccessful in these circumstances. But some Seekers out. They're going to go for it. Fault line down, but it's on the defense here. After shock, to try and clear things out. They're looking to push aggressive. Jogmo paint shells kill again, but Penny silences two kills as he clears out U-Haul and looks to open up the site for his squad. Calm still in heaven. We're all gonna plop down the rendezvous and look to make a teleport play, and it is out to safety. It's Penny. If Penny don't do it, it don't get done. Three, it's four. He wants five. It's in sight, but still U till. To delay the plant for now. As another stun goes out, Jogmo oh, the smoke decimates picture. I'm excuse me, with Jogmo out of the picture, what more can Penny get done? It's calm. Calm's about to run into a very low HP Xander, and he is looking the wrong way. They're pinched here. A short U-Haul, whatever it may be. Penny eventually falls. Nice swing from Reform. He's gonna be taken down. A one for one as Elsa's fighting it out inside the U-Haul here. He won't give it one up. As Elsa's finds another, he's the last one standing. It's 14 HP. This is to map point here for both of these teams. It's the paint shells out and over the top, and Calm is running out of time. But the paint shells miss. Calm has no time. He has to just stick it, and Zelsus can just challenge. Calm will find the kill, but version one will find the round. Version one. Zelsus expecting this to be the case. He took down the dog. Calm's there. Calm's down. Glass pack to try and keep him safe for just a moment. Now use it to get around the corner, and Zelsus survives. Penny reassumes the angle. Won't give it up just yet. Does not want to allow. Reformed anything on the backstab. While this is happening on the site, though, both teams having to run literally across the map to get here. The timing on this one could be big, but the retake from the defender side, it's one. EG just want to go. Now they're pushing into this one. Apoth getting it done. A judge of all things in the Spectre, too. Reformed wants to keep this alive now. One man, the new addition, Ward Elf, a substitute for the one before, though. It'll be a massive challenge. A massive challenge, and one is directly in front of him, jumping around. Bustio falls. The next one, low HP, but through the No! Wardell's got three. He needs one more, but he won't get it. It's Giacomo instead, and we're headed to overtime. He can get something more. Yeah, this is. Oh, he just fell off the angle. I was going to say, this is absolutely. Shindening Xander if he takes a shot and teleports. Flash to the top, both spotted by it. Boosty could be taken down. No TP just yet. Wardell goes good for two, and Xander battles back. And EG just get cut down. Reformed the last one alive here. A 1v1 directly on the site. The spike just behind him on the floor. And he's gonna look to go aggressive. He doesn't even want the spike. He doesn't have the time. He doesn't realize. He, he, he. Oh my goodness. The round is flubbed. They just have to push him now. He has to stick the plant to so the flash over the top. The plant to go down. Now he wants the kills, but there's too many targets. Spike, he didn't realize it was still on the floor behind him. The pressure in these close situations can sometimes lead to those little fractures, those little mistakes showing on through. And Unfortunately, in this one, it means... Snake by use, just looking to delay incendiary. That's going to start cooking, and Giacomo does it again. The paint shells kill, and look at the spikes on the wrong side of the wall. 
Oh, this could get tough. Zelsis takes down Reform, and now in this close corner, Bustio spots out a man, takes one now off the Boombot. He'll swing, but it's a high-low setup. Tuka, so they double back towards A. Those are really the options here. Either one, they'd have a one versus one the timing on this one. Calm on the swing, but he gets oh, nothing no. done! That absolute worst-case scenario. Calm almost had the timing on three players, but speaking of timing, Apoc all the way around through showers. Still trade box. He's been spotted. That's so unfortunate. Wardell had set those up at the very beginning of the round. Now they know one's flanking. If they can get rid of him, or at least dissuade him, they have a rolling thunder to play with him towards the post plant. And this is it for map number one, quite possibly going the way of version one. One player ahead. And we have Effie's Penny and Wardell as they just have to let the spike blow in Apoth and Jogamo. Well, they gotta find themselves at a fuse. Blast pack. Into U-Haul. Flash it out over the top. Rolling Thunders there. Gonna find the knock up on Apoth. He's not spotted just yet. No, yes, he is. And who better than Penny to find free altar for Jaw? Oh, they're gonna wall over it. Oh, this could be massive. And the paint shells at their feet could be massive. What else to find the first? They stay atop the wall. So Jogamo not awarded the kill via paint shells. But instead, Ghost, he tosses out another nade. And his team is just behind him across the map, though. Bustio's still hanging out to make sure. And there's the wall. You can't get back. You have to go through the doors. And Jaw won't allow it. The last one is Celsius. And well, he's the last for a second. And hey, Bustio! Not too much gain. Jaw could be in a rough spot here. Oh, oh Jaw in a really rough spot. Pop timing escapes him and he ends up getting none. I think the timing was a little dissonant on the utility usage. I think that the intention there was to flash Showstopper, go off of that, but you saw the flash went a second after he died. Unfortunate there. Miscoordination from EG, and now they're suffering as a result. The final player here, Zone, stuck on the site, taken down by Xander. Good pinch by version 1, and now the site within their control. Wardell even atop this off angle, holding over towards the rope. This is going to be really tough to break for EG. No reason not to. Just the bonus round, Headhunter. Or Bustio, Apoth just around the corner with the Spectre. We'll see if he's expecting Wardell to be up on the angle. Nelson, ooh, gonna bump him right into the crosshair of Wardell. It works out the alley oop and Zelsis. Heel comes out, reformed backs away. Paint shells right at the feet of Jogamo. A really tough spot, but this was the low HP reformed, and he still finds his first. jogmo has got the spike at his feet. So big. Showstopper though down below. It gets awkward, but Zelsis wins it out in the Rays versus Rays duel. That was the fight that EG could have won, could have turned this tide back towards it, but now they're locked out of this one completely. Stage wall, sky smoke, Molly on down, Bustio though. It's an angle if he can get a shot here onto Xander. Xander gets greedy on the peak. That could maybe change the outcome. Such a tough spot to be in, but nothing to clear him out. As Calm pushes through, Xander does get aggressive, but now it's all up to Bustio. Headhunter out. Seven rounds to work with as a Wardell gonna assume his position. Inside the tower, and just around the corner is Zelsis. So I'm gonna take a couple of quick shots. Unfortunately for Busio, he's out of time, and well, now he's. Busio, let's see if he can do a little sugar zero infection. Added teleport, nice and early. Oh, and going over the wall was Apoth. He had the timing, unfortunately, just didn't quite get the damage. Zelsis, low, and we'll see if Busio, he's given up tower. Back out towards Arcade, he picks up one. Wardell falls, what? and he picks up another. The headhunter living up to its name as he wants more, and. He might get more. He's got the Tour de Force online. Effie's the next up. And the next taken away by Bustio. Orbital Strike. Try and clear out this defense, but it's not going to find too much. And the numbers in favor of EG. But the weapons for version one. And Xander has to hold on all by his lonesome. He's healthy. He's got a rifle. He's got the 1v1. Reform's going to hop on the spike for just a second now. Going aggressive and up close and personal. Reform will clutch it out. That is absurd that Reform manages to win that. Uh, with that. Evil Geniuses are not afraid to really explore the rest of this map. They've been fighting for Dish while the, team, the, the players on the B side are fighting for their lives. Bustio, he doesn't actually get tagged up on the Rolling Thunder. He's able to hit that shot onto Wardell. He wants some more and he'll get some more. Bustio is online, Mimi. They're giving no love to the north side of the map for, for EG, or excuse me, for Vision 1. We haven't really seen a round where they've cleared the space and again they get punished. EG claims that space. They walk up from Dish. They get another kill off of that. And now someone has to make a play. It's looking to be Penny though. Walks forward, grabs one. Can he be cleared out of this position? Doesn't have to be. Teleported back, but behind a sky smoke. Effie's is alone. Gets the force and allows you to remaining. work with though. Reform though. Takes down Penny, so it's just Effie's left. And Calm was always holding. Backed up Dish. They want to make the hit. 
Ooh, out goes the slow. It's not gonna slow anybody just yet. Orbital Strike. Things about to get dicey here on the A side. Meanwhile, in A main. Nobody wanting to give this one up just yet. Jogamo still fighting it for this to walk down. Nothing's happening. Finally gonna jump on, but the, the jump on, but the defense is here. The spike. Still a top drop. Henny got absolutely nothing. He's finally started to walk up towards the alt orb here in A main. And there's 10 seconds. Look at Bustio. He's ready for this left. one. Yeah, that he is. If he just gets the skill, the round is all but over. There it is. Round's done. Spike Version down, 1 do not leave beat. themselves a second option. They do not leave themselves time, and they lose out as a result. Penny, even just getting that wall bang. Nah, man. Player strong on one side. It, a lot of weight on the shoulders. Delsis, the top side of the map. But with the lesser buy, they're going to look to go quick. Slow down for just a second. Then here's that operator. Bustio. Okay. Two kills, man. This guy. He's nuts. And he's looking to get more done. Apoth is still holding up towards an aspect. Same that's denied. That's something to work back in. And now the orbital strike is earned. Strike. Up. Boostio up close and personal. Boostio! Get any weapon. Give him Yuri to fall low. Now they need to try and run him down. The incendiary actually doesn't land. He puts it on the wrong plant spot. Boostio gonna scoop up the ace. And EG, they just keep it moving on position. Spike. Now making its way here, Wardell gonna go aggressive onto the wall to make sure they can't come from the spawn. And there's still a wall for mains. So they're kinda corralled to come through this ropes area, but it's starting to work for now. FD's the first to go. Penny trying to battle back in version one, finally waking up a reform. Might have something else to say about it, and I spoke too soon as Zelsis takes him down. It's Bustio. We need the 3k. There's one. Looking for the next. Through the slow orb, he will go. Blast pack. And open up the doors. Zelsis is going to come through with the ult. And that will be enough. But had to invest the space. EG quick to take it though. Very deep. I mean, there's no contention immediately in this dish position. They're pushing all the way up. They're getting these ult orbs for free. And this is everything. When your economy's starting to take a hit, you can get that ult back online for Zelsis. You can get another opera. He's one away from that showstopper. And you know that's going to open things up for the squad. And he's going to be first to contact quite possibly. Oh, it's Bustio instead. Wardell falls. And the rest of the team, they're out towards main. The spike is planted for him. But what do they have for it? Just the fault line to play with. Now they don't have Xander, it's Penny, and Effies. Torque hand in hand. The dynamic duo. There goes the fault line. There goes the rest of the utility. And it's all up to the right. Look, the flashes come around the corners. They go unchecked. And Effies picks up two huge kills. But the defuse is coming on through. They hop off for just a second. Now Penny needs to try and get back on it. Force the issue. But he just can't do it. Reform. Thunder available. Calm, just, yeah, he's trying to come to reform. Hey man, you, you might get a little bit of friendly fire here. It doesn't matter though, the rest of the squad. Able to help him out, reform still gets his. Giacomo, gonna go kill this here on the round as Penny tries to fight back. Tour de Force, he's got three more shots and four more enemies. One directly around the corner. That Giacomo, and he peeks the wrong way as the door's still open. Effies has to pick up four on the round. This is a very tall ask for any player on any server. Now it's five as the resurrection comes on through. The stun is perfect. The backstab's there. And it's the night. First to contact here. Pushing his way all the way up. Headhunter in hand, but immediately kills going back and forth. Zephy's in reform. Hop their way into the kill feed is Wardell. Tucked in the corner behind his wall. Will scoop up another. And Effies is so darn good with the classic. He's unmatched. Now Jogamo. 24 HP. Six. Oh, uh, and a boom bot right in his face. Okay, never mind. Yep. Right. We'll keep that in the back of our heads as we reassess to the round at hand where Bustio is alone and could be in some trouble. Does he clear close up atop the wall? It's very awkward, but Effies was there to support. Bustio goes down for nothing. This could get tough for EG, but Jaw, fast. He wants to keep this one going. A fight for Zelsis. A swing. The Spectre, the double. Think and more. How does he get so much value? Zelsis for a double. And now only gets. Keeps the value, exactly what we saw. Now the Vandals and Bulldog, well, Effies hasn't quite gotten his piece of the pie. We'll see if he's afforded the sweet So, Well, oh. he chills out over the top. Wardell with the op. We're on the site, making a 2v1 as a cross. It's about to be spotted. Bustio in a really tough spot. Backs away, tries to take the fight. Apop will look to swing. If they kill Penny, this round could be big. He's stunned, but gets away. That rendezvous too good. And Cells is back to the smoke, takes down Calm. Spikes on the floor. They realize that they are spraying for it. And everyone on the scene here for version one. Does seem to be planted though, so a couple extra credits is really all the Evil Geniuses can hope for. Apop that has to do something crazy. He's got the alt, sure, but no space, no presence. Flash out, but reformed?
Get getting blinded by it. Oh, as they go to clear, Reform's able to pick up one, but a one-for-one one trade. 4v4 in the A site. It's been given up. EG seemed to have known this. Paint Shell's out and over the top. So much information. Actually given on over to Reformed in just that one kill. And now this time they should be awarded that plant. Zephy does still have the Rolling Thunder, though. The Aftershock is actually all they'll need to force him off the plant. Nobody really in position to take just yet, but the Rolling Thunder comes on through, and now they're looking to get aggressive. Delayed once more. The Orbital Strike. My goodness, I mean, just so much delay. 45 seconds, the clock continues to tick, and that spike yet to be planted. There we finally get it. The last one standing is the man with the op. And he's got too many angles to worry about here. Not gonna find anything on the first. Out towards main. The tour de force to Bustios. The wall goes up at his back. Wardell in a really tough spot. Now needs to clear underneath site. And well, on the cross, Bustio. Trying to take from the north side of the map. They have arcade. Can they get the site? And very quick through the smokes. Snail go as Bustio picks up the first, but Xander and Epi's uh, holding it down all by themselves here. Finally, the rotations come through, and hey, Penny, welcome on in. When he's able to use a rifle to try and help his team. Sky, so, Sky smokes down once more fast onto the site, though, but stunned up. Jogamo gets nothing. The rest of the squad, but Xander, the Brimstones, they go back and forth as Epi's tries his best to hang on, but Apoth has had enough. He'll even the odds with three kills of his own. Bustio to get the spike plan about 46 HP. The Operator's still in hand, and he's not ready for the angle. Or is he over the smoke? The shoulder spotted Wardell. A huge kill to cut it down to a 2v1. Now Apoth needs to try and do it all by his lonesome. Spots out Celsius. Ooh, able to get the dink, able to get the frag. It's four kills. He needs the ace, but he's got one HP. The Resurrection to get Effie's back online, and too much is showing. Wardell only needs the classic. Go. That was just a clear towards me. This is actually kind of a fake. Find his own the back on the site, but it doesn't matter. Penny still gets one. Still gets away. And hey, look, a rifle. He bought that early. It was waiting for him in the back lines. 5v4 in this week. Looking for Wardell. Finds his kill. It could be big, but he doesn't. And the resurrection. EG back with him in advantage. But out comes the orbital strike from Xander to deny. It's just so good. Ults of plenty on both sides. One of them going to be popped here in way of showstopper. Only going to find some damage, though, as Apoth sneaks away and calm. Buys all the space here. Rolling Thunder on the opposite side. Combo eventually go down, but Reformed is on the angle, and he wins it all for three kills on it. The backstab is perfect, and EG are back. Two to force on. Two to force off as Bustio gets taken down. Apoth stunned up. Wardell wants more, and he's going to get it. Dancing around goes Giacomo, and he's up close. He might do it again. The classic, no, the short. And Jogamo goes huge overtime. Still a possibility here for Evil Geniuses. They only have two more to worry about as the Sky Smokes allow for safe passage. Onto the A site with a plant. It's a showstopper available, but low HP on the raise. The ult's online. It's 48 health. Jogamo needs to be perfect with it. Showstopper pop. This is just trying to zone. They're trying to push version one away, and they've done it. Time is being bought here. Rocket gone. And he now slowly creeping up. Direct contact underneath the site as the cross is being held. To play for contact here. Penny to find the first. Jogamo, four kills on the round. Wants some more. Won't get it. It's Sander. It's the IGLs to try and hang on here. Overtime still on the line. And Tom will do it. They push us to OT. Oh, no, but... Oh, no. Version 1 now. Step away here. They're looking to just take this one in towards the A site. Reach has been revealed, utility has already been used, and now the reply is stun up towards heaven. That wall broken, the boost, and now that breach actually still alive on the site. Tom can get this done. A, a beautiful flash there. I think it got just about everybody inside main in the incendiary. That's going to buy some extra time with 30 seconds. Version 1, they don't have a whole lot of options, and well, Zelsus, he doesn't have a whole lot of health. He's got to back away as the wall slowly chipped away at Bustio, the weaponless chamber. And now the B-side is open for business, and with 20 seconds, it's plenty to get the spike that way. They're just sprinting this one. It is a foot race. Apoth might be here in time. He might be able to contest on this angle. Can Apoth get it done? He's in towards the site. He is ready to fight. Close in this position. Flash blinds him. Now the spike's on the floor, Xander, to trade. The time is nigh. It's a two versus one. Reformed to keep evil geniuses in this round. And he just found the lead in overtime. Poor Bustio. It's unfortunate. I don't I don't think having a gun would have changed things with that flank, but still, you hate to see it. V1 though, they played a good round. Good one book. All five together here. 
You tilt queued up. Sky smokes down. Door open. The paint shells. Oh, it's gonna force it back. No, Jacobo wants to go forward, but it's right on into the aftershock. And Zel Zelsis there to catch the interception. It's perfect. And Sands, you just can't take it from version one. We saw it earlier. We get to see it again. Now, Calm and Bustio have to fight their way out, and they've done so thus far. But Calm is low, and Bustio needs to live up to his first half performance. Spike in hand. Fault line out. And they haven't yet committed the plant. Are they doubling back here? They want to kill before they commit to this plant. They want to punish before they go for it. And they found it. Busio for one. He needs more. He needs this duel. And Busio's done it. Xander now. Alone. One versus two. But he's found the wall bang onto Busio. Now calm. Solo on HP. We've seen this before. A rerun. A repeat. IGL versus IGL. And Xander has the sky smokes. Calm though. Wrapping around Xander. Should realize this. He hears him. He hears him running through. He can get the spike halfway. He's low HP and Xander will do it. He writes his wrongs. And the